Hey Lee. Oh, 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 Come on over to oh, the fender stand. That's Bruce Springsteen and the uh, <laughs> what, what and the, East Street the East Street Band. And yeah. we're here on the fender stand. Yeah. On the fender stand, East Street fender stand. Nam 2019, baby. Yeah. So exactly. the first thing we see is new pedals. Yes. New. Uh, 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 I think it's four, five, five or six. Five, 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 four, five, five, uh, five, new, four. New, what's well, I'm really, the pinwheel, I was just looking at this. Spe uh, it's like, like a, a Leslie, is it? A Leslie with a slow break and stuff. Yeah, so last year Fender got into yeah. the, the realm of pedals. You yeah. probably saw that video. Um, we were surprised, actually. This, these were not, you know, perhaps crappy plastic rebadged no, stuff that maybe all. years ago they might have done. These are designed from the ground up yeah. by uh, a proper pedal man. Loads uh, of cool features. So the pinwheel, the triverb, yeah, triverb. I, I would probably think the, the bubbler chorus. Yeah, because uh, uh, everybody loves a bubble. Um, lost highway, highway phaser. phaser. And this way, come this way. Ooh. MTG tube distortion. Look at all the knobs. Designed with Bruce Ignator, lovely Bruce. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. this says yeah. Look at this. He does a lot of co-op stuff with people. co-op. That's a shop in the it's UK. It's like a shop, it? yeah. And then he doesn't this one, work at the co-op. He doesn't. But and then this one, I'm kind of, uh, I'm, I'm really excited about. But I haven't tried it yet, but. Um, so what? It, this is a bass one, isn't it? So it's a bass pedal with EQ, overdrive, and compressor built in. DI out and all that EXI stuff. EXI out and all this um, different stuff, which we will have to uh, do some videos so yes, once we get back to the Follow the links UK. below. So we pop over and watch the uh, alter, alternate reality. Alternate things. reality. This Come this way. Oh, sorry. Alternate reality is uh, a Mexican-made range of guitars yeah. that they are going to release one of these models every month during 2019. Yeah. Uh, if I'm totally honest with you, I can't remember the order that they're coming out in, but we're just going to show you the order that they're on display in. Telecaster tenor. Tell me what a tenor te Telecaster is, Pete. Is uh, it like a tenor lady? <laughs> yeah, it's like a smaller version. So it's like a Telecaster that when you wet yourself, it absorbs the wee. It just absorbs it. When you sweat really loud in your hands. <laughs> <laughs> it is not that. A tenor is um, four strings. I think it might be tuned like a violin or, or ukulele. It's one you of the two. You see a lot of country players kind of using yes. them, don't you? Yeah, so there's a lot of country players using these. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a niche thing, yeah, I think. A, but it's not a kid's guitar or no, a, or trying to be... It's it's like no. an adult's it's a guitar, but it's a thing. It's a and thing. it's very weird... Um, yeah. It's it's sort of not crazy expensive, but then again, it's not like kids' guitar money. I think no. they're about four hundred pounds yeah. from memory. Looks pretty cool. Ooh. No powder power caster power, power caster power caster. Look at that. What is that body shape, Pete? Is it like kind of a jazz, jazz master, master and jaguar smaller? But this bit over here is yeah, a bit a different bit sharp, and. Yeah. Anyway, it's got a cool scratch plate on Roasted it. Roasted maple neck, 70s headstock. P90 and a humbucker. Yeah, that's, yeah, I like that. That's I like pretty that good. Too. I like to do I that. I like to do that. I like the fact they've got them in a mirrored case so you can see yeah. the back and the front. Hello. Um, without us having to turn the guitars around. Oh. Hello. So. Electric 12. Electric 12. 12 swings. Which looks like something uh, yeah, it's like a the Z coil tuber. thing that we were seeing at GNL, wasn't it, the yeah, other day? Exactly, absolutely. It's exactly the same. Yeah, thing, but I think the it? concept of that is it's a single coil pickup, but it hum cancels, which is kind of cool. Yeah, the sixty-six. Uh, radical looking bridge there. I wonder if that's got some sort of. It. Looks like it might have some sort of piazzo built into it, but I don't know. I've You've made got one that string up completely. and one string through. I think one string oh, goes I through. See. And one th yeah, one string goes through the body yeah. and one string... And you just have to look the at the sound. headstock and say the first thing that comes into your mind after three. One, two, three. Smurf. Smurf. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then, then, Defender 66. This yeah. is my favourite one. Is this your favourite one? Because now when you look at this, you yeah. sort of go, is it, it kind of looks like a strap, but it, it isn't. No. And what it actually is, and when I tell you this, it's going to freak you out and you'll see it. It's a shrunk jazz bass body. How oh, yeah. awesome How cool is, that? is that? How cool is that? Um, so like a shrunk jazz bass body with two lipstick pickups and a humbucker. Lipstick, lipstick. Trem system, big 70s headstock. Yeah. I don't know what the 66 reference is from, because 
1966. I don't think it's anything to do with 90. Although yeah. when England won the World Cup, beating Germany 4-2 in the final, they think it's all over. It is now. Anyway, this is my favourite one. Is it a pizza? It's a meteora. Hey, it's a meteora. So this it's is. It's a fan of meteora. I was walking down the street. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have a 12-inch meteora, please, with extra <laughs> um, extra jalapeno peppers. Um, this is wicked. This is. They did this as an American model yeah. uh, last year or a year before. Yeah. Unbelievably limited run. I, yeah. I think we only got one. Uh, I so, love it. So now it's Mexican. Way more affordable. I'm not going to talk to it. It doesn't hold. matter where it's from. You're not going to talk to it. Yes, yeah, so it doesn't matter where it's from. Hey. And again, what have we got? The slightly bigger headstock, uh, two humbuckers, strung through body, but the coolest, the shape and the scratch plate oh, is, same is lovely. awesome. Yeah, there's something about I it. I love the case this is in. Yeah. Look at the depth. It's just awesome. And you're looking that way and all those things goes around. But they have this thing last year, didn't they? With the, mm. with, It was like all the parts hanging down. Anyway. So, so that's alternate reality. Yeah. So if uh, you're one of the... Um, Six people on the planet that haven't seen the Acoustic Sonic video that uh, yeah. we did. Um, Fender apparently has been an absolutely enormous, uh, enormously positive reaction from yeah. uh, people. They've got lots and lots of orders in. So they've added, this is speculatively, I think. So again, comment below if you like them or not. Yeah. Uh, they've added some more um, sort of luxurious grab, grab tops. Thank you. Is luxurious the right word? So that the regular range are going to have a, have here. got a, um, a spruce top, and they're playing with these ideas of, of sort of printing um, on top of them. Are they printed? Yeah, apparently. Oh, I see. I think so some it, of them was. Uh, so it's still a spruce top, but with like a print. Yeah, I think I think that was what I heard. But oh, you know, wow. you know me. I but might be but, wrong. The, but this is all like different wood, isn't it? Yeah. I well, it's just you know they're playing with no, this. No, you know thing. what? No, I know what you heard. Round the corner is an American flag printed on. Ah, that's so that, what that's what you'll see. These are genuinely we, different words. Because what we talked about was getting a uh, UK flag on one side <laughs> and a European <laughs> on the other side. And maybe a big explosion in the middle there. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, let me show you what uh, Pete was thinking yeah, of. Yeah, this is what I was it's, talking it's about. Stuff it's stuff like, like this. this. Where the, so the well, that's, I like this because we can go, we want Anderton's printed on a guitar. Do you want to buy that? Who knows? I was made in America, Born America, USA. If you see behind us in these shots hey hundreds girl. of guitars on stands covered in business cards, this is the crazy, crazy event that Fender do every NAMM show. They build five or six hundred custom shop guitars, they put them on display, and then us dealers go around with our little cards and we pop them and we go, oh, I'd quite like to buy that, I'd quite like to buy that. And if, like this, you get one with 20 cards on it they put them all in a hat and they pull a name out and and that's the dealer that's lucky enough not to win the guitar just to, to be able it. to buy it yeah. wow um, look at this amp so th this uh this is where this is where i suspect most of our viewers and certainly myself and pete will be going oh my god that's awful it's so gaudy um <laughs> but hey as you but can hey, see by the number I mean, of cards on things, people want to buy know, them. Peep, there will be a, there will be some guy out there will be, which will which will go. I like this. I'm gonna get this, and that's the way that is. Check the back out of that. Look at that. I mean, why? That's all I have to say. But, I mean, I can answer that with one question, uh, one uh, answer, just because. What's going on here? There's, There's like a rope. bit of a bit of rope. Yeah. Is it a, a nautical oh, thing? No, it's like a fish uh, hook. Mo Moana. That's the Moana. thing for Moana. Look, see. What? Well, sing the song that uh, the Rock sang in that song. No, look, if look, you're, look. Um, there you go. Fish hook. Hawaiian if you're fish hook. Uh, into goldfish, um, yeah. then you know maybe maybe a. Uh, I mean, look how many people want to buy this absolute monstrosity of a guitar. Well, you call it monstrosity. Some some would call it the most beautiful guitar they've ever seen. I, you, know? you know where I this is this is surely going it's either going to Japan or it's going to uh, Maidenhead Aquatics well, look, which is a chain of English <laughs> fish shops <laughs> Maidenhead Aquatics that's pretty good that's pretty good that's pretty good <laughs> anyway there's a dude there's a tall dude oh there's a tall drink um, I tell you what there is here to see which is probably the only time you're going to see one of these and the closest you're going to get but is the Jimmy Page yeah have a look. 
There we go. And it says sold out. Display only. The um, Dragon The Tully. absolute legend, king master of uh, heavy rock, Jimmy Page. And violin on um, the guitar. Basically uh, agreed last year with Fender to do a limited run of uh, 50 sets of Telecasters. So there, there are two Telecasters in the set, uh, both from the custom shop, master built. Uh, legend has it that the artwork on the dragon, oh, I've just realized there's no front on this, look, I can actually touch it. Um, the artwork on the dragon, uh, Jimmy did some of this on each of the 50 guitars. They're all signed by Jimmy Page. Yeah. All come with this uh, case. Candy case, is awesome. Cable, violin, bow, violin, picks, and resin. The whole thing. And there he is, the man himself. There he is, legend, Jimmy Page. Looks and, good in high res. And then the other guitar that you get in the set, which this gentleman's just photographing. I'll just let him finish. Is uh, a white Telecaster with some circular mirrors. Can we have a look now? We'll flip um, it so this is the other one in the set. Uh, which, if you're a Jimmy Page fan, you'll kind of recognize. Um, the set, I believe, has a retail price of something in the region of forty-five to fifty thousand pounds. Oh! Um, and uh, all, I'll get a Mustang for that. All fifty are pre-sold, including the one that's coming to Andertons. Yes. <laughs> um, but oh, what's in there, Pete? I don't know. Let's have a look. I guess that's the case candy for that one. Yeah, it is. This hey, is Glenn. He won. Hey, where's Australia? Down to just the other Sydney. Just wanted to say good day to the Capitan. What's happening? I got to go. Yeah, the boys. Thank you. Please. This is. Oh, there we go. This is the the the, uh, the 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 version of the Dragon Telecaster that they're doing out of Ensenada in Mexico. Um, loads of cool signature product has come out of there recently the the Monterey Strat the Hendrix Monterey Strat yeah, yeah. was part of this thing yeah so this is I don't know if this is limited to a number or limited to maybe what they sell this year that's yeah that's what they do probably the latter it? yeah but this is going to be uh, way more affordable somewhere around Mexican about the, the 1200 yeah. pound mark look at it it's cool man it's wicked and that's really light as well how would it do that is it an, it's an ash body by the looks of things? Oh, it'll tell us here. It here. Yeah, thin maybe. Da, 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 da. Custom wound Jimmy Page single Ooh. coil pickups. A custom thin D shaped maple neck with a 7.25 radius. Uh, it doesn't say what the, the body is. I reckon well. it's ash. What do you think? What do you think, YouTube world? Ash? Is it one piece? Is it a one piece? It looks like a one piece. No, no, it's not. It's two piece. Look. Oh, two piece there, but this stuff. Anyway. Whatever. That's how clever the joins are on some of these yeah, things. Yeah, like yeah, you see on the beautiful. top of the heel, it's two piece. Yeah, anyway, two piece. it is what it is. And then the one with the mirrors on it is going to be made in America. So again, you've got a white blonde lacquer finish, custom wound uh, Jimmy Page 59 single coils, same neck profile, 7.25 radius, top loader bridge, yeah. uh, and, and it, it comes with a tweed case. And if you want to take some uh, candles out, put it on your tabletop. <laughs> Put candles on oh, these little tea these. candles. It'll shine up. You know, if you want to do coke off these as well, it's perfect. Brilliant. I bet you Jimmy uh, Page have probably that, done that. Uh, don't quote me on this, but I think it was 2200, 2400, something like that. Links in the description below. Also available from your favorite Guildford-based guitar store. Right, so every year this happens, right? It happens. Some, it happens. Well, not every year, but the, for the last few years it okay, has. Yeah. yeah. So something they call rarities. So, yeah, I don't know exactly what it is. They've had different names for the series. Yeah. Like, hey! <laughs> How are you, sir? Here's them. You bump into people. Yes, yeah, good to see you too. Say hello to YouTube land. Hello, YouTube land. Yeah, I can't... What did they call them in the past? Was it like... Wasn't there like 8 for 10 or so? 10 for 12 or so? Anyway, it whatever. Something like that, yeah. Same idea as the alternate reality. You'll yeah. get... Each one of these models will come out each month in 2019. They're all limited edition. Yeah. They're all American made now. So alternate reality was Mexican. These are American. Um, quite some of these coming. Yeah, quite often with these, because the numbers are much more limited, you'll typically find that uh, they're all pre-sold before they arrive. So yeah. again, jump on the website, look at the specs. And if oh, something really a... stands out and you're thinking, oh, I love that, you're probably best off to try and phone one of the guys at Anderton's and reserve it. 
the ones that Pete and I like the best. It's funny to see them in the flesh after seeing them on a piece of paper because yeah. it looks very different, right? I didn't know this was like an Oreo kind of. Uh, I didn't realize it was half and half, half down and the half, side. Yeah. yeah. I thought it, I thought this was like a veneer top, but it's yeah. it's obviously not. This is the one we all said. Oh, uh, no, not this one. <laughs> This is the one we all... <laughs> no, this one up here, hello. Yeah, not, not that one down not here. that one. This, this one, one up here. Yeah. Anyway, so let's uh, let's move on. Oh, so this was my second favourite one, which I... Oh, I should do it like that, shouldn't I? Um, this one is a, an alder body with a flame maple top, uh, but I liked the neck. I liked the fact that it had like a flame maple fretboard and then it's like a... It's a rosewood neck, but yeah. a, it's completely the other way around, isn't it? A rosewood neck yeah, with yeah. a maple fretboard. That's wonderful. Confused? Confused you will be. And so, the favorite one. This one. Was this one here. Which is, this is not gold foil pickups. This is just covers that looks a bit like it, right? Correct? Yeah, well, we, well, I'm not sure. So not, it's, it's, a, it's a cover top on a, on a ash body, but it, they're designed to sort of look like gold foils and some sort of Filtertron pickup. But I think you're right. I think it is. Tim, well, let's read it off here. Tim Shaw designed the the, the humbucker with a Filtertron cover. cover. Yeah, there you go. And they're basically yeah, the yeah. a regular yeah. overwound 59 yeah. But it looks coils. wicked, man. It looks great, right? That's, that's the one we thought was going to be the most yeah, popular. that's a good one. And there's the bass. Bass, yeah, jazz <laughs> bass. What can you say? What can you say? That looks way better in the flesh than it did in the it photo. It actually do look way better. And this is the Prince one that we thought that's going to yeah. be kicking. But that looks much that darker, was darker than it does yeah. as well. Can you, flip, can you pull that down and flip it over, please? So we pull can... it down and flip it over. Hey. Hey. No, it's I like a Friday see... night. <laughs> Is that Woo! a Friday night going for town? I just want to see what, it, what the... Uh, oh, sorry. You want to see the back? These. This is what I want to see. Yeah. Pearl eye tuners. Yeah. Cool. So there we go. Rarity is kind of funky. And these are yeah. all... Um, way less than like a custom shop strat. Like, yeah. and think of like just an expensive American strat. Hey, hey, hey. What's going on? Hey, man, how are you? Hi. What are you in charge of nowadays? Custom shop. Custom shop. Well, we've bought lots of custom shop stuff. Lee, how lovely to see you, mate. <laughs> this is uh, Michael. He's uh, head of everything at Guitar Center. Very famous man. Hello, Anderson's fans. Why don't you, as your head of custom shop now, in 30 seconds on camera, just Tell us what's wonderful about Custom Shop in 2019. What's wonderful about Custom Shop, not only in 2019, but every day of the week, every week of the year, of every year, is that we are a custom shop. And if you dream it, we can build it. And anything you see in any store, on any wall, at any exhibit, you can order it in any color, left-handed, right-handed, any configuration you want. And the, beauty of, the beauty is, because we're a custom shop, and that's what we do. That was beautifully put. Acoustic stuff. We got the Spotify Not only do Fender make spectacular solid body guitars, but in recent years, they've been making some fine acoustic guitars too. I like them. And I think what they've kind of done is they've realized that everybody makes a dreadnought, natural color, three aside headstock, the uh, boring guitar. <laughs> Everybody makes. <laughs> yeah, they're not boring. And, the, and Fender, you know, and Fender do too. But I think what Fender have tried to do is say, well, look, why don't we do? Let's expand on what nobody else does, which yeah. is the Strat headstock, six aside headstock, and you know, some funkier colours and the shapes a little bit. You know, they're a little bit different shape than others. Um, I'm digging this colour, man. Yeah, me too. I, I like, like the little that. Koa inlay around the rosette. Yeah. So you've got Malibu's at the top if you want a slightly smaller body guitar. Uh, Redondo's, which is the Dreadnought with the cutaway. And New the Porter. New Porter, which is like a Grand Auditory arm. I like, what's that, I like that color. That like sort called, of um, uh, olive, olive green or? That's called Pull Olive off. Satin. Who? Olive Satin. Take it off the wall, I like it. It's got like a gold. Oh, I like I quite like that a lot. Someone's dinged it. Have they? Yeah, discount. Well, this is what oh. happens when you... Uh, Go show. I really like that. That's a good I goal. like the scratch plate with the little indenty bit too. It's like, it looks like a bum. A bu bum. It, it actually like does, <laughs> doesn't it? <laughs> if it was oh. yours, you'd draw a little poo coming or out. Or a flower. <laughs> it looks like a flower. Let's say it looks like a flower. Peter because Hanore. All of them. You're, just, you're just like a New one, one, two, three, Smurf. Smurf. Grand auditorium shape, 12 string. 
Yeah. And an and acoustic bass. bass, The Kingman. Wasn't that a film? The King, King's Men. King's Men. Yeah. Did, you, did you see it? Yeah, great. Was One and good? two, they're great. Oh, ukuleles. Look at this, a little sweet ukuleles, man. Here. I just want to stand in here and. I like I like these. They got this. They got the Fender headstocks on them. We've sold one. so oh, Grace many. Van der right. this so many Fender ukuleles Grace over Christmas. Grace Vanderbilt is. She uh, looks wonderful. My, my, my oldest girl. She absolutely loved this girl. Today uh, is gonna be the day. Gonna it's not, it's it not that. <laughs> it's not Vanderbilt. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not when Vanderbilt. It's great. I bet she's, she's heard that joke a million great, times. She must have. Yeah. She's great. Yeah. She's great. So she's got a sickness to cut out here. Uh, and a smaller one there, and I'm, I can imagine if as Esmala sees this video, Soprano she's going to go. Soprano size, concert size, uh, and these are these are actually kind of like mid-price ukuleles, so not the cheapest you can buy, but not the dearest either. I think the the uh, Venice is about fifty pounds, and the Zuma uh, yeah. isn't Zuma one of the um, Paw Patrol characters? Is it? I think he is. Wow. Anyway, we got kids, haven't we? They're about a hundred pounds. We still got kids. Right, Gretsch. Here we go, Gretsch stuff. So this is uh, this is Gretsch Custom Shop. Um, so we're gonna the, all the regular Gretsch and Jackson stuff is in another booth, which you're going to go to soon. But this is Gretsch Custom Shop. I have no idea whether you'll see any of this kind of stuff in Andertons, but Probably. it's kind of funky. What this do you like? It looks like they've been combined. Look at this headstock with that guitar, with the white and the red headstock, with the red body and the white back. That is absolutely gold. Yep. There's some. So I, mean, I was gonna go. I was gonna go to some Squire over here. As well, oh, we must see Squire, the uh, classic vibe series, which previously has been all the 50s and 60s strats and yep. tellies and stuff like that. Yep. Super, super popular. Yeah, super popular. Has been expanded now to include 70s models. So let's start here. 70s strat. Look at the headstock. Big headstock. So Lovely. you want to be Jimi Hendrix? You can do all this kind of stuff. Um, Big headstock, but in an HSS, H8, speak for me. What is <laughs> that? That's the one. HSS. 70s Telecaster Deluxe. Thin line. 70s Thin Line. Custom. Base 6. Look, proper jazz, jazz masters, masters with, with proper, well, actually, no, I lie. Not even proper bridges. Proper but good bridges. Yeah. With the uh, the sort of the Mustang um, Absolutely. saddles on it. Look, with block inlays and everything. You wouldn't if you proper Mustang. Yeah, if you look at this and you just look straight down it like this, you wouldn't be able to tell but the difference. They've got all the tints and everything on they've the on the lacquer right. bang that, on. Look at that um yeah. look at the, oh. the quilt and flame in that neck. Look. And these are all like I'm, again, you'll have to go to the Anderson's look. website to look up, but they're all classic vibe money, so three hundred ish, three or four hundred pounds. Neck. I don't know. Help That's me amazing. out. Um, so bases, you've got the 70. I mean, oh, that's I think great. That's, that's probably the classic yes. uh, jazz base for me. Yeah. Not all with the black block inlays. Yeah. Look at that color combination. It's you know wonderful. I'm a sucker for blue with a tortoiseshell scratch plate. Classic precision base over fretless, there, white. Fretless. Wherever anyway, I so classic vibe head. is going to go absolutely bonkers yeah. off the back of this. This is great. Um, this is lovely. Wonderful. I've had literally, I've had even friends texting me while I'm in LA going, well, what's the new classic vibe 60s jazz master? Really? When can you get me? Yeah, seriously. It's like, wow. And then contemporary series from Squire, which uh, is designed to, to be a bit more contemporary, funny hey, enough. Funny that. Uh, got these kind of like, Faux EMG pickupy things there. Same on I the like that one. That's cool, Jazz it? Master bases, as you can see. I'm not sure what this SQR thing. Squire, Squire. Oh, I see. Dual Squire SQR ceramic humbucking ah. pickups with active electronics. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That's a lot of stuff. What is this over um, here? There's some other stuff over here, Lee. I'm not sure what that no, is. No, Fender Play is a tuition thing. Oh, that's it. Which Sorry, I was probably looking know wrong. about anyway. Um, Here's a lot of uh, drinks that people haven't finished. Yeah, I might, just left it I might there. drink something up. Again, we're, we're, we're going to dive on over to where the regular Jackson and Charvel stuff is. But by all means, Taylor, sweep down it. I've peaked Dude, seen the one. This. Look at this guy. That's the one. Look at this one. My God. And have a look at this. At Jackson on a. Uh, <laughs> this is a, I'm all speechless. Look at all this stuff. It's amazing. Lee, check this out. Look. 
how can I so it's basically a firebird with Jackson on the headstock <laughs> a Floyd Rose in pink it's it's a bit like I don't know is that a nightmare or a dream oh oh is it a uh, I don't know oh <laughs> that's so bad <laughs> so bad it's good this, this look yeah have a look at this I need to move the cards up here oh here we go look it's just it's just great oh that's pretty cool isn't it it's like it's like a Flash Gordon model here. It is, yeah. This is what. Um, this is, uh, or it's a David Bowie model. Or a David Bowie, yeah. You're Lightning probably right. Bolt. Flash. Ah. He's there you go. one of us. Beautiful. Yeah, that's pretty cool, isn't the it? The Galactic Funk Strat with matching Wawa and uh, matching cable. Just you, need, you need these. Uh, you need these cables, Pete. I'm yeah. going to hashtag you in a picture of this cable. <laughs> yeah. Hashtag me in. Hashtag Purple Pete. Are you looking at me or are you looking at you? Are you looking at me? Don't look at me. Look at me. Look at me when I'm I talking mean, to him. If you've always dreamed of having a guitar finished like a peacock's tail, dude, what is this? Today what could is be this, your lucky what is day. This, uh, shape, headstock shape, because that looks a bit weird. Not to me, but the headstock shape on this, is that just a bass? Well, it's. Telecaster it, bass shape? It says ab Abuelo bass, but if I'm honest with you. I've never seen one of these I've before. I've never in my seen life. one of those either. They, I like this. This is cool. Uh, do you know what? This That's is. Cool. Right, here we go. Q the sad violin music imagine you're like you're a girl or a boy and there's like 700 of you at a disco and every single one of you somebody wants to like yeah, dance like, like with. this for instance yeah like this, this one. one this is the this is the super popular girl oh, everybody wants to dance with this girl and uh, and then there's one girl nobody wants to dance with that one. and there <laughs> is, so is the only guitar here <laughs> That with nobody no wants to dance with. What's going on with that? That's the original. Uh, what uh, the original Telecaster looked like before it was called a Telecaster. Oh, Gibson is going to sue them. No, well, that was before. <laughs> so the Snakehead Telly. Snakehead is that's the original headstock that was on the like the real early or late forties, early fifties. So this is where I'm going to Have sneeze, they done it? Sneeze, Taylor. Have they done a turtle head as well? <laughs> <laughs> they have. Fender ramps. I love. <laughs> We like Fender amplifiers. I love Fender um, amplifiers. Absolutely, big fan. There are some new models. Yep. Um, in no particular order. We'll just start down here. Chris Stapleton, uh, massive Grammy, American country Grammy star. Grammy winning country artist. Yep. Toured and recorded I just, with early 60s brown Fender prints. I'm reading the top oh, of it. Yeah. If you don't know Chris Stapleton and you're a fan of uh, country music, or just go and check him out. He's amazing. So they've done a they've done a reissue of a, a, an early '60s Princeton, uh, yeah. a signature for him. Uh, it's top end money wise, about yeah. two grand yeah. from memory. But there you go, it's pretty yeah. sexy. Is there new Fender bass breaker? Yeah. So some of the bass breaker amps have been discontinued. Yeah. I think the bigger ones, like the maybe the 1830 and stuff like that, didn't do so well. Uh, but the hugely popular bass breaker was the bass breaker 15. And so they've kind of done a, a like a, a big brother version of that. So bass breaker 30R, all tube, 112. Same kind of idea of your different kind of gain structures. Two channels. But two channel this yeah. time, yeah, reverb. 112. Uh, four EL84s. Woo! I'll put for a speaker, XLR out, emulated switch, and power amp mute, blah, 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 all of the blah, good blah, stuff blah. that you need. You I know, think that's what I'm going to do. I think I think that's the best. We should you should do these cardboard things, and you it should, should just say blah 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 blah. All the stuff in red, like <laughs> a couple blah, of features, blah blah. <laughs> Total flavors from blah to blah blah blah. blah, blah. High game, High game blah. blah. Mustang series, Sally. very popular. Yeah, Mustang Sally. So the currently the smallest Mustang is the GT40. Yes, correct. Did you drive one of those the other day? Yeah, no, it was a not a GT40, unfortunately. It was a Mustang. 5 litre 5.0 convertible anyway. and it made me laugh and I'm still smiling so the LT25 is going to be uh, even smaller yeah so lower wattage uh, simpler set of features More lower simple. price yeah that'll be cool uh, what's it let me have a quick read here blah 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 uh, 25 watts I was just trying to see if it was obvious speaker. as to what was different between this and the bigger one 8 in speaker um, Blah, 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 know. blah, blah. We'll have to do a video on yeah. it, Pete. Let's do that. Do that. New base, LT25. A Rumble LT25. I believe, the, the, I don't 
I'm not sure now. I think they did release something last year, they a little did. bit bigger, that yeah. which was this sort of programmable rumble thing with effects built in it as well. And yeah. now they've just done a smaller one. Yeah. This one, the Champion 50 XL, was the one that you saw Lee, uh, uh, Rabia and me do a video on where we compared it to the did you, did you know? Did you know we got guinea pigged on that? Well, I say we, as in Europe, was guinea pigged on that. Oh, so really? Fender did the first few of the Champion 50, sent them over to Europe to just sort of see how they got on. Yeah. You, you did the video with Rabia going, actually, we think in some instances we like it more than Katana 50. Yeah. Yeah. And then Fender went, thank you. And now it's part of the line in America well, as well. I'll tell you what, for the amount of money this costs, it's a great little uh, yeah, practice at home, man. Absolutely. How on earth do you get 800 watts out of something that's the size of a piece of toast? Is that stock on there? No, it's not. Oh, it's quite man. heavy, isn't it? No, it's not. Well, no, you're not. Well, I suppose for 800 watts, it's not heavy, is it? I've um, always loved that logo. It's, sexy it's classy, isn't it? But there yeah. you go. It is what it says it is. If you, it oh. says here, blah 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 <laughs> blah. <laughs> With a uh, 800 yeah. watts is all you need to know in a very know. compact. That's a bass amp, obviously. Yeah. Uh, this it's, looks great, man. Yeah, they're, they're honestly, actually, this they're actually looks not really new. Cool. Just the, the, the Fender acoustic amps, they're quite expensive, and that's why I don't think we've ever really done much with them. But oh, really? They look awesome. They I do would look love cool. to. I would love to try to do something with that. I they would love great. to try to do something with that. Yeah, I'd like to do that. Well, there we are. That's uh, our uh, annual trek around the Fender stand, In 2019. My knees hurt now. Is it? You're getting uh, old, Pete. Uh, yeah. Um, so I hope you've liked what we showed you. Of course, it's a bit of a whirlwind tour. It's difficult for us to plug anything in here. Yeah. But of course, we'll endeavor to do as many follow-up videos as possible to this. Yep. So read the links below. And even if like months down the line after the show you're watching this, we'll update the links. So if we do more videos, you'll see. But absolutely. tell and, me uh, who this guy is. This is Tom Mears. And uh, he, we would like to get you on the show, Tom, if you're watching a uh, great guitar player, great singer-songwriter. Funky. I've played some of his stuff before. Awesome. I've used some of his little licks and stuff in the videos uh, where people are going, oh, that's his. Uh, no, well, yeah, cool. as always, so if we you would, like to, we would love welcome. to read all your comments below yeah. about what you liked and what you didn't like and what you're hoping Andersons gets into the store and what you hope that we video. Uh, it's all really useful feedback for us. So Absolutely. please comment below. And uh, yes, yeah. subscribe. Stay tuned, a bucket load of videos goes oh, up over the next this, four or five yeah. days. So apologies if we're overloading your inbox with YouTube notifications. But it just, there's 1,500 exhibitors here. <laughs> we're going to try <laughs> and there? see as many as we oh can. Loads of videos. Okay. Love you guys for watching. Thank you very much. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Blah. <laughs> <laughs>